guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing good, and I'm back with another travel vlog. Oh, it's been so long since I posted a video in my channel and I know it's been very long uh, since I posted a travel vlog in my channel as well but then I'm back with a new video and this is a weekend vlog basically so this is on a Saturday uh, actually it was very sunny on Saturday so we thought let's go somewhere we thought of going to a beach but then we already saw all the beaches in Edinburgh so we were actually searching on Google and we found the amazing place which is not Berwick and this is like a 50 minutes ride from Edinburgh yeah maximum 50 minutes and it's a beautiful place guys you should definitely visit for a short trip if you you know don't want to go really long but then you want to go somewhere new then this is the best place for you guys it's actually getting warmer in the UK as you know uh, it's springtime uh, so this is the best time to visit new places Today, I'm in North Berwick so this is like one hour away from Edinburgh and if you want to like uh, you know go for a weekend getaway I think this is the best place and right now I'm in my first stop my first destination is a castle and then we also have beautiful sea over here This view is really amazing. Wow. And and did you see the castle? This is built in 1300s it seems guys. Look at that. Actually they are not allowing anybody inside the castle. I think they are undergoing some repairs I guess. But then we can you know come into this gardens and we can you know see the nice sea view and then you know take some beautiful pictures. So this is my first place to see in North Berwick and I'm going to also show you like different places to see in North Berwick throughout the day. And the castle name is Tantalon Castle. Uh, as I already mentioned, this is a very, very old castle, guys. And that's the reason, you know, it looks very old as well. And there are a lot of repairs going on just to make it, you know, look really nice and then this is a defensive shield so basically they used to you know uh, fight uh, through those holes i guess you know with the guns and all uh, so it was really nice to imagine all those things which they used to do in olden times and uh, this is actually a really beautiful place it looks very sunny but it was damn cold guys i you know it was i'm really freezing on that day i really wish i can see the castle because it's so beautiful and it's built in like 1300 so which is amazing guys and i really love history and old castles so i wish i could see that but it's closed so we can't help it but otherwise it's really nice it used to look like this look at that it was really beautiful and it became like this as i mentioned it's very old so it's very common and i really wonder how they built this much big castle literally at the edge and this is a small uh, house for pigeons it seems in those days a lot of pigeons used to reside over there now let's see another beautiful place did you see the huge rock in the middle of the sea yeah that's one of the attraction as well guys it's called bass rock uh, and you know there's a lot of history to it as well uh, you can just google it so that you'll get to know the history of it and did you see it's literally the castle is literally at the edge as i mentioned earlier and there is a huge rock in the middle of the ocean so it's actually called a uh, bass rock it seems uh, we can actually even go and land over there but then uh, i think we need to take a ship uh, they, there are usually uh, rides as well like you know you can go from city center to there and then i think it's around like one hour trip and then it costs you around 21 pounds per person i guess and um, also uh, you can land on it and then if you want to land on it i think it's going to cost you around 50 pounds or 60 pounds per person so you're actually not going uh, there today but then if you want to go you can actually you know google it and then you can book uh, tickets through online and then you can actually visit that and it's actually a volcanic rock uh, it actually looks very beautiful and i also heard that there are a lot of gannets in there gannets are you know it's, it's a different type of bird i'm just going to post over here uh it looks amazing I, I really wanted to go there and see those but then you know it's very cold in here if you want to go you know through ship 
it will be damn cold and I really can't even bear the cold so that's one reason and then I really don't want to go today but then you know, when I come next time I might visit that but if you want to visit you can you should definitely check online and it's called Bass Rock you can google it and yeah that's the rock and this is a closer look of the castle guys guys I really want to tell you guys something and let me know how many of you guys feel the same so basically there are lots of amazing places to see here in the UK or Scotland it, but then it's very cool to see any of it guys trust me like whenever I go to a trip and then whenever I go to like different places to see I will always be in hurry I just wanted to go quickly and then take pictures quickly and then come back as soon as possible just because of the weather I couldn't like thoroughly enjoy the beautiful series just because of the weather guys I know we have to dress appropriately but then if I dress like it's winter then I won't get amazing pictures if I have to get amazing pictures then I have to dress like this if I dress like this then I can't enjoy the view I can I will enjoy it to some extent but then weather wouldn't let me enjoy it at all. Then we'll take it today. It's very sunny. At the same time, the winds are horrible and I hate winds here in the UK. Oh my god, my I'm literally freezing right now and I'm you know I really don't want to see any more places just because of the weather. Just let me know how many of you guys feel the same. If it's like a little hot here in the UK, it would have been amazing. Trust me, guys. Oh my god, I just hate this weather. This is the biggest drawback of staying in the UK. But then I'm still trying to, you know, enjoy as much as I can while I'm here. So, yeah, these are really the struggles of cold weather. Horrible weather, especially the winds. Oh my god, I'm literally freezing right now. You all can see it's sunny, but then I'm freezing, so imagine. So we just came back uh, from the castle and then we are going back to Edinburgh because there are, you know, there are not many places to see here in North Berwick, but if you want to go to beach, then you know, you can obviously go to the beach, but then I didn't want to go to beach today. So we just uh, saw the castle and the bass rock, took amazing pictures and then we are just going back. It's afternoon, so it's lunchtime. So we are going to a Indian restaurant in Edinburgh. So I'm just going to show you that as well. And uh, yeah, this, this is like beautiful place to see in North Berwick. This is like a short and sweet trip if you wanted to come during week. And I'm back in Edinburgh and this restaurant is called Rishi's. Uh, so this is in Leith, guys. And if you wanted to have amazing dosa and if you're craving for one, then this is the right place for you. Dosas here are amazing, guys. I just love it. And then even biryani and other curries are really, you know, tasty here. So you should definitely try it if you haven't already. And do let me know, like, you know, what are the other places where... You know, there is amazing food. I would love to try it. That's it for today, guys. I hope you really enjoyed the short travel vlog after so long. And if you really want to visit North Berwick, then you should definitely visit the castle, guys. It's beautiful. I definitely recommend it. And if you want to visit the beach, even that's very beautiful. And then, and do not forget the boat ride to Bass Rock, guys. I hope you will enjoy it thoroughly. And then, yeah, do let me know in the comment section below if you like this video and if you like travel vlogs, then I'd love to do more of these. And yeah, that's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll be back with more videos. Bye, guys.